Hey y'all, hey y'all, hey. Welcome back to the channel, The Crafty Closet. Today I'm going to be converting my Eco Tank printer into sublimation. Stick around. Okay, y'all, so let's get started. So I'm converting the Epson EcoTank 2803 into a sublimation printer. I know it might seem really difficult, but it's really easy, y'all. I'm going to show you how to do it in a really easy, quick step. So, you know, I posted a quick snippet. I converted a black Epson EcoTank. It was a 2400 into sublimation. Well, y'all, that thing broke down after 27 days. The printer, feeder... The, excuse me, the roller for the paper stopped feeding the paper into the printer and it was a wrap. I knew once I put the sublimation ink in, my warranty was voided. So, you know, it was a blessing in disguise. I wasn't happy with it anyway, so I just went and decided to upgrade to the Ecotank 2803. And I'm so glad I did because this thing prints like a beast. I'm going to show you what I mean. So, the first thing you're going to need to do this... This is great because it has a screen. It's nice and big. Don't use the ink that comes with it. You're going to need to use sublimation ink. I am using Hippo brand sublimation ink. Got this off of Amazon. It had really good reviews and it's the ink I used in my previous printer. So I just went with the same thing. Now you're going to get four tubes to put into your printer. And I like this because it actually fits right into the the, the print tanks like it snaps right in no problem so we're going to open this up and then we are going to just pour this ink into our uh print tanks uh let me um let me just go on here and get i forgot to get something y'all so that's why i had to come back all right so now i'm opening this up and now you can see you got your black your blue your uh, magenta and your yellow so you get all four colors and now, this is really easy. What you're going to do is just open up your little latch right here. Now, you're going to be making sure that your ink fills in those little clear little uh, clear case down at the bottom. So, you're just going to look for your ink to fill at the bottom. So, now we're just going to easy open this up. We're going to flip it over and we're going to just pop it into our ink tanks. This is why I love this ink because it literally fits inside the tank there's no fuss no mess and you just pop it in you're gonna watch as your ink fills in here we go y'all let's go
Mm-hmm.